Hello everybody. It's a wonderful day here on Skalat here in, in the Faroes. I wanted to make this video because I recently passed 5,000 followers on my YouTube channel. So um, <clears throat> my first idea was to make a guitar instruction video of some kind. Uh, but I found out I don't really have the time. So I started setting up for that yesterday and I soon gave up because it would simply be too time demanding. But I wanted to make something on the occasion of 5,000 YouTube followers, so this is it. Um, another reason I wanted to, uh, to make a video is that uh, YouTube recently up updated their uh, policy towards uh, verified partners. And uh, when you're a verified partner, you're eligible for monetizing your videos. It's not very much money, very little actually, but uh, the requirements are you have to have a thousand followers. I have now 5,000 as I told you, and you but you also have to have 4,000 hours watched on your channel the last 12 months. And I do not have that. I have maybe a third of that at the moment. So I, that's another reason for me to really make some, some effort here on YouTube to keep, keep that number up. In my experience on, on Instagram and Facebook lately, my, the videos that do best are my studio updates and landscape videos. So I thought I'd do both at the same time here. As you can see, this is Skalafjörren, one of the nicest places on the planet. And I always get um, comments about how nice the landscape is. But believe me, there are much, much more spectacular landscapes to be seen in the Faroes, but they're not that easily accessible. It's been unusually calm here lately for January. This is storm season, but it's been completely calm now for a week, I guess. Uh, it's about two to four degrees uh, minus uh, Celsius, that is. Uh, and there's no wind chill factor. There's usually a wind chill factor of five to 10, but this is beautiful actually. And um, as for studio, yesterday we recorded some choirs, Gunnar and I, and I believe I said on Instagram yesterday also that I have the lyrics for six songs written. That was in fact untrue. I have five lyrics written um, and uh, I've recorded my vocals for four songs and today I will record the fifth song and it's back to lyrics writing. It takes, takes a lot of time to write lyrics, it takes me two or three days to work on, on uh, a text until I'm satisfied with it. So that's what I'll be doing for the next four days. Um, we've booked studio time with Jacob Hansen from the 19th of February and onward. We'll use that time to record drums and do the mix. Uh, it's possible we'll not be done with vocals when we get that far. And we'll just do the rest after and send it to him and have him mix it like the songs that were already done. So things are progressing, getting, uh, of course, closer and closer to uh, uh, being finalized, but everything takes longer than, than I expect. I, I underestimate all burdens of work and this has been no different. However, there's some tours being worked on at the moment. After the album's done, of course, we'll start touring. Some of the tours may happen before the album's released. I hope, we, yeah, I expect we will play some of the new songs, even though they're not released, and you'll be able to hear them there. Uh, won't be long, though, from we start touring till the album's released. I, I expect two months at most. And the tours we're planning, uh, cover the entire world. Well, 
uh, maybe I made that sound a bit more famous than I actually am. We have no plans for Australia, no plans for Asia other than Siberia. So, of course, I hope, I've been hoping for a long time that we'll go to Australia and Japan, uh, China. We've been getting some feedback from, from, well, from Australia for at least 10 or 15 years. And we've been getting some feedback from China lately and from, from Japan also. Uh, although I have to say our, our biggest market at the moment and for the last, well, for an, our entire career has been Germany and, and the US and no difference there. So hoping for Japan, China and Australia, but unfortunately not working on any specific tours there at the moment. What you sh should not do is write to me and ask us to come to Japan or, or China or Australia. What you should do is write to your local metal booker or your local metal venue and tell them you would pay or you would buy a ticket to see Tuir at your venue. That's how it's going to happen because I, uh, when, I, when we plan a tour, we contact a booker and he contacts his local people here and there. And if, if I tell him I want to play in precisely this and that place because such and such person asked me, it would be micromanagement and it would be just be a nightmare. And I have enough nightmares at the moment. Anyway, I think that's enough for this time. Before I leave you, I want to remind you to follow me on Instagram, I'm here you SN, and on Twitter, where I'm also here you SN. Then, what else is there? Oh my god, there's so many places. Facebook, UNSN.theory, I'm sure you can find my Facebook page on here you SN. And um, like this video, please, subscribe to my channel, and if you like this, I'll make some more of it. I'll uh, leave you with the very nice view of the fjord that's called Skala Fjord. Cheers.